Good afternoon, folks. Well, we got the rocket stove done. And we already got a fire built here. I've been burning for less than 10 minutes. Ugh. I think this is like red fur that's burning here. Uh, fence post. Um, here we got a warming tray and we got the ovens done. So I wanted to give this a little time to heat up to see uh, <clears throat> how uh, how warm those ovens get. But so far, I'm not too uh, too impressed. To, sun makes it hard to even see what's going on. I can't read it through the camera here. I don't know if you can see that. 400. Two fifty. Four thirty, but it must be a little bit hotter because we've got to, we went past the blue. On the grill up here, They're even getting a little bit of smoke. We got a little bit of breeze out here, but she's making a noise. There's 600 degrees on the side, so once that metal heats up, see it only showing uh, 170 degrees on the bottom there. That door don't close all that well. Ugh. Anyway, I guess we might put some paint on it, and make it look a little bit more presentable. hear the roar down in there or not but but regardless I know that we can uh, we can grill up here with no problem boil water cook on it uh, whatever we might need to do uh, did shorten my uh, handle on the uh, ash dump there So it's more than a little out of the way, but yet easy to grab. Anyway, now I guess we just need to use it a few times and see if there's any uh, anything we'd like to change. Give the ovens a little more test, see if they're even worth uh, fooling with. If they're going to be, if they're not going to be useful. Uh, I guess if worst case, uh, they would keep things a little bit on the, or keep it warm, but I, I don't know that it's uh, going to get hot enough to put some spuds or a lo uh, bake a loaf of bread in there. I'm not a cook, so I don't even know what temperature. Well, we're too, when I first uh, opened that, I was 270 degrees in there, so, yeah, it might, uh, don't think it's going to be very efficient trying to bake something but oh god 
enough trees around here, uh, dead branches. Uh, I need to do some trimming. Matter of fact, I bought a electric pole trimmer. Uh, and so, if I start collecting that stuff, uh, you know, the amount of fuel that it uses is not going to be a, an issue. And uh, get her stockpiled. Um, yeah, have to uh, test some charcoal in there next because I <clears throat> wouldn't want to direct grill necessarily on that pine. And we don't have any hardwood around here. May have to keep an eye out for some cherry wood or something from an orchard. Be about the only way to get uh, some hardwood around here. Most uh, popular and willow. I don't think either one of those would be very flavorable for uh, cooking on. Oh, that's uh, say that's it. Maybe we'll catch one uh, cooking on here sometime and. Uh, do an update. Get uh, the main thing here, we're ready to or have a way to heat up some food. Cook a pot of beans and a bowl of rice if uh, things go uh, south. Uh, It uh, seems like you hear more and more of that uh, September, October. So we'll see. If not, we will uh, we'll just have a fancy uh, cook stove here. Monday, uh, we're going to have a big fish fry, so maybe uh, be a good time to try it out. Uh, cooking the fish or hush puppies or something keeping them warm uh, expecting about 30 probably around 30 people and we're gonna have a fly fishing demo so uh, yeah it would be a lot of fun well like I said, I'd like to use this a little bit and then uh, I guess the plan for the next would be uh, I'm going to build a like a 4x4 four four, or one out of 4x4 four four, and uh, maybe try to keep it on the lightest side as I can because this thing here there's no way you're going to want to really load it up take camping with you or anything like that so we'll build one maybe a little bit of portable or uh, want to get really light uh, I got some ammo cans and I seen some done uh, in a in an ammo can which would be uh, kind of neat if I get time it would take long to throw one together because had an on online auction yesterday and I ended up winning 12 of them uh, 50 caliber cans so I got a lot of a lot of animal ammo cans to uh, experiment with all right, well, that's, uh, I guess, pretty much wrap up this uh, series uh, in the uh, six-inch rocket stove. Um, like I say, we cook a meal or something on it and may uh, have any major updates from here on out. We, uh, we'll, uh, we'll shoot another video and upload it. Thanks for watching.